Coach, huge win for your team tonight. Talk about what a monumental victory this is for you, your team, and this program. Sure, not even as much for me, but more for these guys. You know, I mean, this was a, a loss that we needed a remedy from last year. Um, a 22 nothing, get out the gate fast, and then just spiral out of control. And as I told these guys all week, th this loss last year really unfortunately transcended the, the the season that it had I think I really think they win last year against this team they go 2-0 and walking into Chalmette go 3-0 and playing at a different level man you know against Rummel and so continuously talked about that this whole week you know we want to be where those guys are you know credit to the coach Manali prior to and coach Graham he's continued that and that's a hell of a ball club and more importantly that's a hell of a freaking program man the last seven years you've heard Dillis Sal's name mentioned as a state contender um, and so like I told them it may sound like week two. Uh, why are you so high on this win? Because we haven't won a lot. You know, I mean, we're, we're, we're one win away from tying and going into week three. What are the most wins we've had in the last three years? You know, so um, this was huge for us, man. And like we talked about, this was a culture program, the culture win for us. Offensively, you found success in the passing game all night long. Yeah. What did you guys see? What kind of you know, man adjustments, man coverage? <laughs> it was man. You know, we talked about it all week. We, we knew that they were going to give us an opportunity to make plays on, on the perimeter. Um, and look, I'm going to tell you, you know, Kobe Young gets a lot of notoriety. So does Cross Johnson, Derek Johnson, our three running backs. But the unsung hero, man, that nobody pays attention to is number 11, who's standing in the back of the end zone. They just don't account for him. Um, and so Finn Martin did a great job tonight. And uh, Cole, obviously, leading the charge. And then, more importantly, our offensive line did a real good job of protection. Yeah, and then talk about last your defense. You held them. You know, to one score in the second, yeah. in the first half, and that came right at the very end. Sure. What did you guys see there? You really to to dominate the line of scrimmage. Yeah, I you know negative plays. You know, I mean behind the line of scrimmage, I thought we did a really good job of. Unfortunately, man, we, we let them hang in a lot a lot more than what I, I you know what I would have liked to do. Um, you know, we had opportunities for interceptions, um, and we, we missed them. And, and honestly, that missed interception led to the touchdown. And then over here, the missed interception yeah. led to another one. So if we learn how to finish on defense, man, and get ourselves off and get our offense back out, this game, honestly, in my opinion, would have been over a lot earlier than what it was. It got, it got closer than it needed to be. Well, congratulations, Coach. Good Thank luck you. next week. Thank you. I appreciate week. it.